You the owner of this house? It can't be here. Gotta give you a ticket. I hate to do it. I hate to give you a ticket. But it's my whole job. It's the one thing I do. Look, you can leave your house here if you really want to. But you just gotta get more tickets. <laughs> Move along. I gotta focus on giving you this ticket. You know, Jorb, I don't think you're very nice to me. Oh, that's fine. I'm okay with that. Well, it's not fine for me. I'd like to see, just for one second, a little respect out of you for your father. You understand? Yeah, I understand you want that. But maybe you don't understand that I don't have to give it to you. Maybe you don't understand that you're not always gonna get exactly what you want. Boo-hoo. You just have to accept that not everyone is gonna like you. Sometimes that's a random schlebe on the street. Other times it's me, your own offspring son, who hates your guts and tells everyone at school that you won the award for Galaxy's Tiniest Peter. I literally tell everyone I know every chance I get. Most of them don't even know who you are. I just... I have no reason to tell them, I just do it because I hate you so much and because it's fun for me. Hey, hey, he used to be a really super good boy. I don't know what happened. No harm in looking, right? <laughs> Wonderful! Excellent! All right, a deal's a deal, no take backs. Have a nice day!
kid, would you have problems finding me on space tinder? I think you'll be happy with that. Goodbye, bounty hunter. That's right, I knew you were a bounty hunter. Discerning customer, would you be interested in some quote unquote food? Go! Go away! Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I'm Blordo. You here for the food? Or the other stuff? <laughs> what, what do you mean, other stuff? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Forget I said anything. <laughs> no, come on, we're, we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine. I sell secret shit if you know what to ask for. But don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. Get a good eye. Good day to you, food customer. Good luck out there. I'm gonna go explore Blim while you're out there bounty hunting. Hey, be careful out there. Humans are a valuable commodity. Someone might try to snatch you up. I can take care of myself, Gene. Fucking kidding me, we had to get here when there's a goddamn sandstorm going on, bunch of fucking sand in my eyes. No, you're you got a helmet on. No, I don't I don't. Yo yo Piece of shit, you don't, you can't relate to this. Why don't I have a helmet? You're getting me the helmet upgrade the second we're done with this shit. Wait, what's that sign? Sandworms. Oh shit, that's right. Okay, yeah, we we, we gotta be really careful. dangerous out here with this fucking weather. You never know what kind of shit's gonna fly into your face with the wind and the sand, but but we should be able to make it to Drek Town if we just, you know, trudge through it. Oh shit, Greebles. L look at them go. They eat up broken ship parts. Does it taste good? I no idea. I'm not I'm not about to give it a taste test. Guys, 
to shoot. All that damn time, all you want me out of here, do you? Whoa! Hey! 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 Yeah, the G3 don't have... Oh, I think that's Old Town in the distance. You know, that was the first settlement out here, pre-G3. We gotta pass through there to get to Douglas. I am so proud of you, son. You look, you look so good, son. Yeah, a wreck like this is pretty normal on Port Turin. You know, this asteroid's always been a lawless land, but now that the G3 set up shop, it's even worse. Here's something cool. They brought this thing down with a big magnet. They just sucked everything down. Like a magnet is so powerful, it just sucked everything up. You know, the scavengers on Port Turin, they get real creative. Trust me. Now, don't let the locals hear you say this, right? Keep it under your breath. But Port Turin is really G3 territory. They've got their claws in everything out there. Hey, 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 watch out, watch out! Hmm, I can see that coming in handy. Grab it up. You're smart enough not to hop into that toxic green shit, right? All right. Drag town. I only got to go a couple of times, and the G3 had me chipped, so I couldn't actually do anything. So I don't really know if it's fun or not. You know what I'm saying? Like I can't, I couldn't be a a, a Drag Town critic because I really don't remember or 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 know anything. Really about Drag Town? I don't know. I don't remember. Old Town's just past this bridge. You can't miss it. Oh, check out that little tiny city over there. Oh, hello there. <laughs> I'm Cutie Hubie, and it's my great pleasure to introduce you to Little Cutie Town. <laughs> We're a nice, peaceful society full of cute little one-inch tall guys who love each other and only know how to be nice. We welcome all strangers with open arms and a full heart. I'm so, so glad you found your way to our sweet little slice of heaven. Please, we all hope you enjoy your time here. Go on, step inside. 
Trust me, friend, you'll have the time of your life here in Little Cutie. Oh, fantastic! You've decided to take a look around Little Cutie Town. Oh, I'm so excited for you to see everything Little Cutie Town has to offer. Oh my god! Oh no, 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 oh no, you're destroying everything! Oh my god, you're so big! I, I, didn't, I didn't realize how big you were compared to our town. It, Oh my god, it's really obvious now. I just didn't realize how much damage you'd do. Oh my god, I shouldn't have invited you in. Oh my god, what did I do? That's my childhood home. You just stepped on some puppies. Oh my god, this is the... Ah! That was our power plant, our nuclear power plant. Totally safe, by the way, until you came and triggered a nuclear reaction. It just wiped out an entire neighborhood. Hundreds of happy families dead in an instant. And the radiation will linger for decades, killing anything that tries to grow there. So you're just gonna keep, you're gonna keep running around my, my cute little town and smashing stuff? Like, you're just gonna have fun with that? That's, that's what you wanna do? You know, you can leave, you can get out of here and do anything else. But you're not, you're just, you're gonna keep knocking stuff down. Okay, alright. I'll just sit here and watch, I guess. I'm powerless to stop you. I'm so tiny and small and weak and cute, there's nothing I can do. If I wanted to stop you by force, it's, it's just not an option for me. Oh well, this the, um, uh, this sucks. <laughs> I've said it before and I'll say it again. This fucking sucks. Okay, that's it. That's my whole my whole town, my whole little cutie town ruined. You've ruined the whole city and all my friends are dead. I'm the only last little cutie alive and I am going to kill myself, I guarantee it. As soon as you walk away, I'm gonna be so depressed I just pop a gun in my own head and I die. I'm just gonna fucking die. How's that sound? No more living for me. I don't wanna be alive. My whole town and home is gone and dead and you did it. It's your fault. I know I invited you in, but you should have realized you're so big. You're gonna ruin things. You should have told me. I didn't think about it. I'm kind of dumb sometimes, but you're you're not as dumb as me I, I assume so you should have said hey I'm not gonna go in there. I don't want to stomp on shit like a big Godzilla not for me Not my, not what I want to do with my life. I don't want to go kill everybody That's what you should have said instead. You just did it You walked in and you knocked over entire buildings. Everyone's dead now. I am I am so sad I'm so fucking sad right now. I know that I, I mostly I'm just yelling, but if you if you let me just calm down for a second, which I'm gonna do, okay? I'm gonna calm down right now. I am so fucking sad. I'm so fucking depressed now. Do you have? A, can, just shoot me. Shoot me with your gun. Go ahead and shoot me so I die, so I don't have to kill myself. Just. Whoa, Jesus! I wasn't sure if you were gonna actually kill him. Poor guy. You know, maybe it was the right thing to do. Whew, uh, yeah, I don't, I, th that's on them, right? For inviting us in, you know? Think about it. All right, Sorry, God, that's all the Greebles. You, you know, like I said, it's and, uh, it's fine you know, that you, you killed what, them. So you know, no, no, nobody's gonna be spot, mad. No one's gonna be missing them. The end all do all of uh, construction. You know what I mean? Hey, listen, uh, uh, I'm gonna chime in here. I'm gonna say, fuck you with the support beams. Fuck you with the stairs. You're both a couple of keyblowers. And you know what? Fuck you. Oh my God, you gotta call me a keyblower again. You son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I can't believe you called me a fucking keyblower. Can't be called us a keyblower. Are we even brothers anymore? Are we even brother? Are we even related anymore? You're gonna sit here and call me a keyblower. You make me fucking sick to my stomach, brother. You're a fucking sick human being, brother. I'll tell you that much. All right, look, look, look. Take it easy, all right? Okay, listen, Jimmy, make your case for support beams. I'm willing to listen. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Joey. All right, so support beams, what do they do? Well, it's in the name. They support, and they're beams, and they go from the ground up to the thing that you're building, you know? And yeah, sometimes they gotta be tall. That's part of the game, you know? So don't, you know, look at me with a cross-eyed look and call me a fucking keyblower when I'm fucking talking about a goddamn support beams and you're getting all pissed off at me. You know what I mean? The support, it's for the support of the thing. And uh, well, what are you gonna do? You ever seen those houses with the big old support beams coming from the bottom of the- Whoa, 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 wait, tough whoa, guy. Whoa, whoa. Hey, 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 look, walk wherever you want. This is a fucking Mac and Cheese Brothers construction site. We ain't done here, but you gotta be careful. Whoa, 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 whoa. hey, calm down, what the hell? 
How do you want to handle this? Maybe we just, you know, move past Are you them. kidding me? You think you could just walk up into a Mac and Cheese Brothers construction site like you're some sort of fucking Jesus Christ hey, and just don't, fucking don't walk fucking around like you own the place? There's a goddamn bottomless pit over here, asshole. You think you could survive that? Falling through a fucking bottomless pit down to the bottom? I don't think so. We got work to do. Oh, okay, dipshit. Get here. the fuck out of here, oh, whoa, whoa. asshole. You know? Hey, What's fuck your you. Big deal, you piece bro. of shit. You walk in hey, here, you're hey, pissing hey, me hey. off. Me and my Mac and Cheese Brothers oh, were pissed. I can't believe you know, this. What do we got? Fucking run away, you little. Hey, what the hell you doing? What's your big deal, bro? Hey, what's your big deal, you? Oh, I can't believe this. What are we doing? Hey, what do we got? Hey, hey, hey. hey what the frig? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Holy shit, those guys are intense. You know, you could have killed them, man. Fine with that, I think. Oh, hey, idiot. Nice jumping. so far. like some tough guy. Hey, fuck you. Oh, look, the fucking asshole can tether. What did you do? Hey, try not to slip and fall into that bottomless pit, you fucking asshole. Okay, yeah, I, 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 I'm, the, I'm, the, I'm, the, I can help with this. Move through this place and we'll we'll get to Douglas. Snapper's looking to get into Old Town. Hey, we should talk to this guy. I calls him like I sees him. He, he seems helpful. Thank you. 
Howdy there, partner. Welcome to Old Town. They call me Old Wet Grundy. How can I help you? So, uh, well, you know, tell us, what, what, what is this place? Well, I just told you it's called Old Town. Back when settlers first landed on this asteroid, we formed a little trading post free from galactic law, where anyone could come and do as they please. Nowadays, Town steals all the thunder, but for a few years there, Old Town was nothing to sneeze at. All right, so Old Town is the old town, and Dregtown is the, the, the new one? Old Town has heart. Used to serve a real purpose for the people. Dregtown is just a pit of debauchery and drugs. The concerned G3 cartel. So, uh, why do they call you Old Wet Grundy? It's cause I'm old, and I piss myself every day. I'm doing it right now. You're, you're pissing yourself while you're talking to us? Oh, yeah. Big time. It's still going. Ooh, this is a good one. And how do we get to Dregtown? It's, it's, it's been a little bit for me. Oh, that's easy. You just go through this gate, pop into Old Town, and shoot straight down the main strip. You can't miss the big Dreg Town entrance. It's a real goddamn eyesore. Wish they'd get rid of it. I'll open the gate for you. Oh, well, thanks, Grundy. That's old, Grundy. And of course, opening the gate's my whole job. It's why I'm here. I'm happy to do it for some charming young women snubbers like you. Hey, do you happen to know where we can find a, a, a guy named Douglas? Douglas? The, 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 the G3 fella? <laughs> oh, wee. He's a rough one. Never seen somebody drink as much as him. Why, just last night, uh, nope, I, I shouldn't speak out of turn. The G3 don't like that none, and I don't like them. Just head down to Drag Town. I'm sure you'll find them. Have a good time in there, youngin. That party last night was crazy. Did you see how wasted Douglas got? Hell yeah. Joining the G3 was the best idea we've ever had. Oof. <laughs> hey, I think they just mentioned Douglas. Me too. I'm all fired up. I just want to start some shit. Hey, look at that weirdo in the scary bounty hunter suit. Let's get him. G3 causing trouble. feeling that there's probably some more G3 causing trouble, you know, somewhere around town. We, we should, we should maybe de deal with it. Thank you so much for saving me. Oh my God. Thank you. Uh, but you know what? I kind of, I'm kind of thinking I would have fucked him. So now I, I don't know. I'm going to go think about that. See you later.
You know? Okay, I think I think that might be all of them. What, what, what do you think? All right, either way, let, let's just he head to Dregtown. You don't belong here, so get a move on. You don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. Uh, my name's Kento. You probably have heard of me. I go to all the town hall meetings and complain about all the G3 recruits coming up to Old Town and causing a ruckus every day. I'm pretty famous. Oh, oh. I can't talk right now. I'm drafting my next town hall speech about how annoying the G3 are. And it's it's really good. I use a lot of big words. Oh, oh yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, some trouble? What are you looking at, stranger? Drunk recruits. Learned anything from Douglas? I'll get it this time. Nobody's gonna 
miss you. Things have quieted down a little bit, you know. Th thanks to us, you know, quite a team we are. Anyways, uh, l l l l let's uh, let's poke our way into Dregtown now. Let's go to Dregtown. Did you stop all the troublemaking recruits in Old Town before I even asked you to? That was gonna be a whole quest thing! I, I was gonna ask you to do that before I let you in the gate. But but hey, you're a go-getter. Uh, you just kill that asking. I, I love that. Head on in. Uh, thanks. Oh, you wanna talk to me? You got some questions for me? I mean, do, do you like sitting here guarding this gate? Seems kind of boring. Oh, I hate it. Worst job I've ever had. All the new G3 recruits come busting in and out all day and all hours running around, shooting the place up and causing trouble. I'm always really freaked out I'm gonna get shot and die, but <laughs> hey, it's a living. So, uh, you know, I'm just just making small talk here, I guess. But what, what do you what, what, what do you do for fun? Oh, plenty. I usually go down in a drag town and get fucked up. I love doing Fergals, but I've been hearing great shit about those new humans. Uh, yeah, I've been saving up to try some out. Oh, 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 and I've been binging Space Version Frasier. How do you like, you know, li living in Dregtown? Oh, of course. There's always a ton of cool shit to do. Uh, gambling, shows, dodging straight bullets. This month they got Zubles doing a big show on the main stage. I'm gonna go see him and ask him to marry my daughter. You only get one shot, you know. Can, can you tell us a little bit about Dregtown? Oh, it's your classic den of sin and villainy stationed on the underside of an asteroid. You know the drill. The, the G3 kind of runs things unofficially. They're just everywhere down there. They, they got a whole training facility and everything. So, you know, classic shit, like I said. Mercs only! No bounty hunters allowed! You heading down to Drag Town? It's way cooler than Old Town. I, Old Town's a boring dust bucket, I'll tell you that much. I hate Old Town. I just stand around here telling people how much Old Town sucks. That's what I do. That's my that's my cool. That's what I that gets my rocks off.
The G3 really spruced up Dregtown. You can get anything you want down there. Drugs? Sure. Sex? Yep. Those are the only two things I can think of. Oh wait, laptops. You can get laptops, I bet. Drugs, sex, and laptops? That's Dregtown, baby. Are you going to join the G3? You look tough. I bet they'd love to have someone like you. Hey, have, have fun in Dragtown. Be careful, a lot of G3 guys down there, and they're a bit trigger happy. Well, goddamn, that, there, there's Douglas right there. Uh, that's how you know we're in the right spot. Mothers care. Against Violence. Oof, well, so, that falls in our favor, huh? We don't, we're not gonna have to worry about any trouble in this area. Moms here in Dragtown got together at the last Mama Palooza and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really care if they die, we just happen to be moms who hate violence. Have fun out there, kids! I'm Senator Thomas Michael Phillips, and I support Mothers Against Violence. Wow, so this is what a G3-run city looks like. Anyway, yeah, I'm excited to join the G3, but I'm gonna miss my wife and six kids. Oh yeah, I had mine killed before I left so I wouldn't feel bad. Wow, that's so smart. I'll do that too. I'm gonna kill my wife and kids so I don't miss them. Like I was saying, my brother told me Douglas is really into torture. Like, sexually? Does it matter? Yes, to me it needs to be sexual. Why are you telling me this? I barely know you. Oh, my bad. Yeah, just sort of spilled out. Well, now you know. Do with it what you will. I'm not doing anything with it. I hate the G3 like everyone else, sure, but hey, if the G3 wasn't here, who the hell would be buying my sounding rods? Sounding rods? Yeah, it's a little metal rod you stick up your urethra, if you got one. It's the family business. We sell little metal sticks you shove up dick holes. You think you're better than me? Well, you are. You 100% are better than me. I'm dirt. And the G3 wants to buy all my sounding rods, so fuck off. Uh, okay, uh, all right then.
I hope we don't have to meet Douglas. Yeah, jeez, that guy scares the shit out of me. He was trying to play Gary alive at the party last night. He should have. Honestly, Gary's a racist. Oh yeah, Gary needs to be flayed alive for sure. Just, you know, there's a time and a place. Maybe we shouldn't be talking about this stuff out loud. Were you guys at the party last night? I can't believe Mipulon showed up. Oh, I saw. Mipulon is so cool. He was looking real good. Easily the hottest G3 officer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nipulon's not as hot as Sector Giblets. What? Nipulon's way hotter. Trust me. And he's got charisma. That goes a long way. Oh, they convinced me. Let's join the G3. decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our bag, you know? You were all at the party last night, right? Douglas was fucked up. Oh yeah, that guy was pounding the back like a full-grown scribulon, which are like the Irish of space, in case you didn't know. But you do know, we all know space stuff. Yeah, goddamn, I don't want to stereotype, but I bet 50 pesos Douglas has some scribulish blood. You know what? I'm gonna go look into that. Part of the Mothers Against Violence. Damn! Can you believe they built all this on the bottom of an asteroid? I mean, I, I, I'm not gonna lie. It's it's a good place to hide out. I mean, but yeah. Well, all us moms here in Dragtown got together at the last Mama Palooza. As often, bozo. my child. I'm from a sweet little organization called Mother's Four. All right, finally! It's been a hot second. That's right. Think mothers against violence, and then there's uh, Mother's Four Violence. We're a little different. We love violence. Okay! <laughs> Fucking dealing with some grievals over there, dumb fucks. Oh yeah, here's the loot. Hey, uh, don't forget to use my glob shot, you know. We got a warp base.
guess let's just kill them all. How many of you motherfuckers are there? I know what the after one is like, I died. Kidding around, that, that was violent. Wow, a real G3 training facility. Maybe Douglas does the training Douglas in again. person. This is about the torture. Okay, listen. Uh, the last yeah, yeah. I'm get in trouble. <laughs> this one is about how I love torturing. It's not an ad for anything. It's just like a reminder that part of my job is also torturing people. Enemies of the G3, random strangers who looked at me funny, anybody. I'll torture whoever. Doesn't matter to me. I just love doing it. Okay, that's it for this one. That's a wrap. Hey there, freaks and geeks. Check, check it out, it's the G3 cartoon. Hey, hey. 
Hey, you, check this out. I got some goop here. You're gonna love it. You can use it to sneak in. Come over here. How old are you? Hey, hey, you can trust me. He's fine. I'm trustworthy, I promise. Check this out. I got some goop here. Hey, hey there. Thanks for coming over here. I'm the goop guy around these parts. You wanna sneak in the G3 facilities? You gotta get covered in goop. That's just how it goes. My stuff's quality. So you, you, you want some goop, right? Uh, you know what? Yes. How about how about a big fat yes? Let's go. Perfect. Head down the alley there and just uh let the magic happen, I guess. Uh don't don't worry. First goop's on me. Just tell all your buddies about it. I'm the goop guy. I do goop stuff. Oof! Oh my god! Oh gee! Oh my god! Not not what I was thinking. Oh! Oh! This fucking! Oh my god! The smell! Oh my god! I'm gonna fucking throw up. Okay. Hey, look at you! You're all gooped up. I gotta be honest. It won't last long. It's not the real stuff. So you better be quick. Get in. Get out. Don't stay in there too long. Don't lolly. Oh, looky here. We got another gooped up G3 recruit. Be advised that the G3 cartel is not responsible for any life-threatening injuries you may incur on these premises. But even if we were, we wouldn't give a shit. Who cares? I hope you get shot. Good luck. Uh, thanks. 